Hello guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you could properly straighten out your fins on your intercooler by using these pairs. So we're just going to go ahead and try to straighten it out as best as we can. Want to be gentle with them don't want to apply too much pressure as already they're bent they can be very brittle they're not going to be perfect but this is better purpose of an intercooler It'd be a lot better than just having bent vents and looking all ugly and shit. All right. So after uh, getting at it for about a couple minutes or so, you can see the extremely damaged one end up scratching some of the paint here, but extremely damaged fins turn out to be a lot better. These are completely messed up. I'm gonna keep trying to go at it, but if you're having trouble straightening them out, found it better to pinch at the top, just bring it down like that. It ends up being a lot more straight at the top, bring it straight down, pitch at the top, bring it straight down. Like this one right here. It's in a terrible condition. But if we can pitch at the top, bring it back, hopefully we can straighten that out as best as we can. It seems to work out. I know uh Sometimes not everybody has a intercooler fin straightener, whatever tool that is, but I know there's a tool out there. Hmm. Sound like a Honda maybe. Came out a lot better than expected. This is going on my 2005 Legacy. All right. Thank you for tuning in. Hopefully uh, this little trick could help you. If you don't have it, you could use this tool. Everybody at home should have one of these tools. If not, ask your mom or your girlfriend. And yeah, here you go. Thank you for watching. Hey guys, if you found this video helpful and feel confident fixing your intercooler fence, please like and subscribe. Turn on that sweet notification button for more helpful videos. Peace out.